For WTSA News and for Brattleboro Community Television here on your Thursday, October 31st, my name is Ian Kelly. These are some of the stories we're following at this hour. Severe weather has caused officials in Hinsdale and Chesterfield to push back Halloween trick-or-treating until tomorrow. Other celebrations, including the Brattleboro Horribles Parade, are still on. Authorities ask that anyone going out wear clothing that can be seen by approaching vehicles. Green Mountain Power is preparing to respond to severe weather forecasted for this evening and tomorrow, with meteorologists calling for up to three inches of rain and winds topping 50 miles an hour in certain parts of the state. Winds are expected to kick in later this evening. The National Weather Service issued a flood watch for Vermont starting at 11 p.m. Scattered outages are possible with this combination of weather. A New York man will spend 12 years in jail for robbing a credit union in Hinsdale. The New Hampshire U.S. Attorney says 42-year-old Joseph Krako of Poughkeepsie was also ordered to pay $2,798 in restitution. The robbery took place December 21st of 2017 at the Service Credit Union branch located in the Hensdale Walmart. Investigation by the New Hampshire State Police and the Hensdale Police Department ultimately traced the defendant to Poughkeepsie, where detectives from the City of Poughkeepsie Police Department identified the defendant in images taken from the credit union security cameras. Krakow was found guilty by a jury on September 25th of 2018. Early absentee ballots for the special school merger election to be held November 19th are now available in the Brattleboro Town Clerk's Office. Anyone wishing to vote prior to November 19th may apply for an early absentee ballot until 5 p.m. November 18th. Early absentee ballots may be voted in person in the clerk's office, mailed to the voter by the clerk's office, or picked up by the voter, or if a voter is in need, can be delivered to the voter's residence by two justices of the peace. WTSA Sports, congrats to the Nats. The Washington Nationals, for the first time in their 86-year history, are World Series champions. They beat the Houston Astros 6-2 last night. Pitcher Steven Strasburg named the series MVP. A pretty amazing run by a team that was almost out of contention back in May. Locally, in a Division I semifinal, uh, semifinal boys soccer match, number four Brattleboro faces number one CVU in South Burlington with the game scheduled to begin at four. And in girls varsity field hockey action, Bellows Falls upset CVU yesterday in a Division I semifinal. Bellows Falls will now face number one Rice at 11 a.m. on Saturday at UVM for the state championship. For WTSA News and for Brattleboro Community Television on this Thursday, October 31st, happy Halloween and be careful tonight. My name is Ian Kelly.